famous siblings have been on the silver screen for many, many years. My sister Jennifer and I spent four years of our lives in the 80s on television. This is true. And his brother and sister, sure, we fought a couple of times here and there. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. But they were absolutely the best memories of my life. We're going to take you on a tour back to, to show you some of our favorite AB siblings, whether they just played them on TV or if they were actually related in real life. My sister Jennifer is my special co-host today, and you're watching a new episode of Chris Kelly from 80s TV. Chris, I love you. I love you too. Please stop touching me. After all these years, she says the same thing. Boop, boop, boop. <laughs> Hi, I'm Chris Kelly. In the 80s, I spent four years of my life on TV. So that was an awesome experience. But you know what else I enjoyed? The movies, the TV shows, the pop culture, the music. Everything 80s. So let's talk about that and more. Welcome to Chris Kelly from 80s TV. Get ready. Family Ties was a huge successful sitcom in the 80s. Focused around an American family, it aired on NBC and it was premiered in 1982. It focused around three siblings. Alex Keaton, played by Michael J. Fox, Justine Bateman, who played Mallory, and Tina Yothers, who played their baby sister Jennifer. It was a great show because it was realistic in the fact that they were a great family, their parents were hippies, but they were all hardworking with real life trials and tribulations. It was a huge hit. So we want to share with you how we relate to each one of the shows that we talk about today. The first one we're going to talk about is Family Ties. So of course, we think of Mallory and Alex. Yeah, they were just like us. And you always wore a tie up to here and a shirt, just like Alex did when you were on that dance show that we were on. Yeah, but who wore first, Alex or I? Yeah, well, who had the haircut first, Alex or you? Same haircut, they had the same haircut. In 1984, another show debuted on NBC. The show was The Cosbys, and the family was The Huxtables. There were five siblings, but my two favorites were Denise, played by Lisa Bonet, and her brother Theo, played by Malcolm Jamal Warner. So now let's get to another fun show, The Cosbys, The Huxtables. Good family. Very good family. I love that the mom was a doctor. I thought that was cool. That was cool. Yeah. But what I always remember was uh, Denise, the sister, played by Lisa Bonet. She was always like super fashionable and uh, just cool. And he, you know who that reminds me of? Who? Oh, Chris. You. Aww. My sister was just the same way. He's just too nice. <laughs> and you always remind me of Theo, because poor Theo had all these sisters. <laughs> and you had a couple sisters yourself. I get it. Brothers. So a lot of times by our sisters, we were just misunderstood. But we're good brothers. Two of my favorite siblings from the sitcom in the 80s has to be Joni and Richie Cunningham from Happy Days. In 1987, another great show debuted on Fox. Love it was my favorite and family. Marriage. Love and marriage. That's right, you know what it is. What is it, Jen? Married with Children. That's right, Married with Children debuted on Fox in 1987. It was a great family, and they had two great siblings. It was who? Kelly? The hot one. We all know you know who it was. Young Christina Applegate, super hot, and wore a lot of bikinis. I think she was very smart and knew her fashion. <laughs> and her brother was Bud, played by David Faustino. Mm -hmm. Now the family, they had some issues. A little bit. They made me laugh. But at the end of every show, they pulled together with love. And if you messed with one Bundy... You messed with all the Bundys. Christina Applegate. Mm-hmm. She was really hot back in the 80s. She was a great actress in that role, and uh, I give you all the props she was. in the world. She's a very intelligent woman. She really is. <laughs> but sometimes uh, you would see the fights between her and her brother, Bud. Yeah. Um, we fought a little bit and played tricks on each other. I think that's probably the, the funniest piece, but... Uh, the pranks. Yeah. I loved it when they would get each other and the pranks. Like the time I put shaving cream in your underwear. Uh, yeah, but it was the menthol shaving cream, guys. I put my shorts on and it was like, ah! Oh yeah, and then he would get a huge bag of rubber bands from the corner store and he would just wake me up pegging me with rubber bands all morning. Do you remember that? I can't believe you just told them about the shaving cream story. Thanks for watching another episode of Chris Kelly from 80s TV. I also want to thank my sister for being here as my special co-host. My pleasure. It was so much fun. You rock. Thanks. Who are you? Please follow us on the web. Like me on Facebook at Chris Kelly from 80s TV. Send us a note. Tell me the favorite things from the 80s you want to hear about. 
And if you feel like it, tape a five second clip. Let me know what your favorite things of all time in the 80s were. If selected, I'll add it into a future episode. And thanks again for watching us at Chris Kelly from 80s TV. Wait a minute, you forgot your famous line. What one's that? You can take the siblings out of the 80s. But you can't take the, the 80s, 80s out of the, the siblings. siblings. Thanks again.